hi everyone in this tutorial video i'm going to show you how to check the date an account was created in office 365 generally we can always check this information from the audit log in the compliance center here i'm in my uh, compliance center from compliance you go to search and uh, you can go to uh audit log so we can always check this information on compliance center but uh the issue with this method is that uh generally audit log are kept for 90 days but if you are using a uh, subscription such as uh, m365 e5 or an add-on like uh, m365 e5 compliance or m365 a discovery and uh, audit then uh, the audit log can be kept for one year by default and then up to 10 years if you actually uh, set up the policy and then assign it to user for uh, 10 years so but in this tutorial video I'm going to show you how to use PowerShell to check the date the account was created so using the PowerShell method it does not really matter if you have uh, any license or if you don't have uh, the e-discovery license because it's not actually based on the license so the dates or the parameter are kept in Microsoft Office 365 and it can be checked anytime so let me quickly go to my PowerShell to show you how to do that so we are going to connect to our exchange online using the global admin credential so I'm going to connect to Exchange Online. So um, so we connect to Exchange Online. Okay, I'm going to enter my uh, admin password. Okay, so we are going to connect. Okay, so uh, that is connecting. So I'm going to use uh, we are going to use this account as an example. So this is a command let that we are going to use. So we are going to say uh, get mailbox and then we are going to select this parameter. Okay, so I'm going to launch that now. Okay, so uh, as you can see, it's showing us when the account was created and uh, there's still some other thing. For example, let's say we can also do something like this using a white card and uh, click on this and then you can see it when the account was created when it was changed and when it was created in UTC uh, typically there are so many other parameters that might be useful for you that you might want to check so you can make that visible using this partial commandlet right so you can see a lot of different parameters that can be checked here so maybe possibly there might be some other information you might want to check so it might be uh, useful for you to come in here and study each of these one by one and be able to filter out uh, the information that you really want to check so that is where i'm going to stop for today's tutorial so if you find any value in the tutorial please subscribe to our channel so that you can always get notified whenever we drop new tutorial like this thank you have a lovely day